Hi guys, Take James here. In this video, I will show you guys how to get trophy hacks on your PS Vita and unlock any trophy for any PS Vita game you have installed. So there's probably like a main question with this, will your account get banned? Now I'm not too sure. If you literally got unlocked platinums and every trophy for every game you've got, then I'm going to say yes, maybe your account could get banned. But if you just casually, you know, unlock a couple of trophies and don't go crazy, you should be all right. I'm on one of my rubbish accounts. Um, that's just the name of it. I don't really use this. I think I've only got about, there you go, four trophies on it. So if this gets banned, I don't even care. But I will be unlocking some in this video anyway. So let's just come out of this real quick. You can see I've only got what a trophy on black ops 2 and a couple of trophies on adventure time and this is on playstation network so this will come up on my account so what we're going to do is we're going to just close out of this i was in trophies if you're wondering what that was and let's just go ahead and open up vita shell because we will need to connect our ps vita to our pc so let's just press select and just connect it on your computer quickly the link will be in the description for Trophy Hacks SE version 1.1 and this wasn't made too long ago it was just made in December so if you guys want to get this all you want to do is just click on the download link right here and it will begin downloading. So once it is finished downloading what we want to do is just go to our downloads folder and just find the new VPK in here and we're just going to drag and drop this on the root of our PS Vita. So once it is just transferred across we can now go back onto our PlayStation Vita and I will show you guys what to do next. Okay, so now we're back, we can actually install the VPK, so let's just find it on our UXO. It's this one right here, Trofax SE, press X, X again, and then just X one more time, and it will start installing. So once it has installed, we can actually just close out of Vita Shell. Close it down and let's just open up Trophy Hacks. Now you must have a game. Um, this is the game that I was actually going to unlock some trophies for. It's pretty much the only game I've got. It's just Adventure Time. Uh, I have been playing it before, but I haven't really done anything. So if I just load this up real quick. I've only got like two trophies on this or something. So li literally nothing. Okay, so what we can do, we can close out our game. You don't actually have to have it open. We're going to keep the trophies thing open, and now we're just going to open up Trophy Hacks. So it will list every game you have on your device. For me, Adventure Time is the only game I've got. So we can press X to confirm, or circle to exit. It will be highlighted in red when it's selected, so I'm just going to press on X. It's then just going to load it and try and find it. So now there's two options, well there's three options, unlock a trophy, unlock all trophies or exit. You can unlock all, this is a bit risky, I probably wouldn't recommend it. So I'm just going to select the first option which is unlock a trophy. Now what this will do is actually let us select what trophies we want to unlock and you use it just by scrolling up and down on the d-pad. So let's just get some random ones. Um, how about we get the red throne, we're going to press X to unlock, we're going to um, use real secure ticket, and then it's going to start unlocking, and there you go guys, you can see at the top, I just got it, we can do it on other stuff as well, you can pretty much unlock as many trophies as you want, um, I wouldn't do it like go crazy or anything like that, but yeah, you guys get the idea. Now if you guys are wondering what the other option is, the use fake secure ticket, if you press X on this, you can basically choose the date when you got it, so we could choose like 2018, press X to confirm, then skip a few seconds, and there you go, it will say that is when we unlocked it. So what we can do, we can exit out of trophy hacks, let's go back onto our trophies, and let's take a look, it's going to resync itself over on PlayStation Network, and there you go, Adventure Time is 13% complete. We can tap on it, and we've now got six trophies. So yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. That is how you unlock trophies on any PSVT game you want. Um, do be a bit careful with this, um, because I'm not 100% sure if you could get banned for this. I know it is pretty dodgy. Um, obviously, don't go and get a ton of Platinums, because that's just going to look really suspicious. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.